What is that? 62nd percentile? Yeah. That's you. That's where you rate. All the bachelors in New York, we're all competing for the same women. We're the straight bachelors. And I'm in the 62nd percentile? Yes, sir. Well, in other words, I'm better than 62% of the New York bachelors. Well, you're rated higher than them, yeah. But worse than, what, 38%? 37, no 100%. How'd though. you come up with 62? There's all science figuring it out. There's a science of figuring it out. Well, that sounds very scientific. You know, if I may inquire what you're rating. Well, you should ask. Because mm -hmm. I happen to fall right in the 99 percentile. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Who came up with the ratings? I didn't. You came up with the ratings. Mm -hmm. Then you get a 99. It's very interesting. Yeah. What are these uh, based on? It's just a system. I mean, that's your rating. I mean, it's, I'm not saying you're a bad person, Jay. No, you're just saying I'm a bad bachelor. No, you no. Know, you're, you're better than an average bachelor. What are, what are the criteria? First, money. You have none. Trust funds don't count for shit because it's a red flag that says mommy and daddy could turn off the cash flow one day. So that right there keeps you at the top 10%. 10% of the gold diggers? 10% period. Two, you got chronic bad breath. No offense, but most women won't sleep with a guy with stank breath, so. Fuck you. No, you don't have to get so annoyed, all right? I am annoyed. What puts you in the 99th percentile? That's what I'm wondering. Okay, well, first of all, I, uh... What, the, besides your salary, all the money you make. Right. I happen to be blessed with a very big dick. <laughs> Genetics, man. Doesn't dyeing your hair drop you down a few places? Nope, not at all. It only bother women if it bother me. Going gray does bother you. No, it doesn't. Of course it doesn't. If, you, if it didn't bother you, you wouldn't smear that goop all over your scalp 10 billion times a day. Hair's a non-issue, Jake. Well, is dirt table manners an issue? Yeah, that silver thing to the left of your plate, that's called a fork. Yeah. And when people eat rice, they use chopsticks or a fork. And yeah, grown people don't eat fried rice with their bare hands. <laughs> no, you, with, like, you don't know how to you, behave. You bust my balls in the way I eat? You spend the whole week figuring out how to defraud foreign governments, whatever you do, and then you, you get out of there and you go out to the strange world outside your office called reality, and you don't know how to behave. Oh, yeah? That's my case. You tell me about reality? Jacob, you're a rich Jewish kid from the Upper East Side who's ashamed of his wealth. <coughs> you walk around unhappy 24-7, trying to make up for the fact that you were born privileged. Fuck that. You know what? That's just some knee-jerk liberalism bullshit, man. You call that reality? 